I'm Anil Kumar and in this series based on circle theorem we have a couple of practice test questions. Here's question number seven for you. ABCD is a cyclic quadrilateral with tangent TA making an angle of 42 degrees with the chord AB. So ABCD is a cyclic quadrilateral means all these vertices are on the circumference of the circle with the tangent TA making an angle of 42 degrees with the chord AB. So, so that's the chord AB making an angle 42 degrees with the tangent. Rays DC, DC, this is a rays, that means this is a straight line. This is a straight line. Rays DC and AB, so that is extended at intersect at E. So, so these are straight lines which intersect at E. DC is parallel to tangent TA. So what we're given here is that this line is parallel to the tangent TA. An angle ADB, ADB is 50 degrees. AD, I think there's a typing error here. It should have been because I've written 50 here. So I'll make this as angle DAB, okay? So I'll make this as angle DAB. So angle DAB, as shown in the figure, is 50 degrees. Find angle ADB, find angle ADB. So ADB, let's connect D and B. You have to find angle ADB, this angle. And AED, AED, and that angle, right? So let's call this as X and this is Y. So I hope now the question relates to the figure we have here. You can always pause the video, answer the question, and then look into my suggestions. Now to begin with, let's start with the cyclic quadrilateral. Sum of opposite angles should be equal to 180 degrees. So we are given 50 degrees here, we can find what this angle is, right? We can find what this angle is, okay? So, so the angle DCB should be equal to 180 degrees, take away 50 degrees, that is 130 degrees, right? So this is 130 degrees. This we got from cyclic quadrilateral. Sum of opposite angles is 180 degrees. Okay, well, but we didn't ask for it anyway. What we need to find is these two angles. Now to figure out this angle, what we can do is we can use the angle between the chord and the tangent. So whenever we are talking about angle between the chord and the tangent, we look into alternate segment theorem. So we look into alternate segment theorem. So alternate segment theorem says that the angle which is between the chord and the tangent should be equal to the alternate segment angle which is actually opposite to the angle of this angle opposite to the segment we are talking about. So that angle. So from here we get this angle 42 should be equal to x. So we get that the angle ADB equals to 42, I mean 42 degrees, right? Since this is 42 so that is from the alternate segment theorem. Okay. How do we get Y? We are given that the rays DC intersect and DC is parallel to the tangent TA, right? So what you can observe here 
is a Z pattern. So that Z pattern indicates that we're talking about alternate angles. So in parallel lines, alternate angles are equal. And therefore, the angle AED should be equal to the angle EAT. And therefore, Y or angle this is equals to 42 degrees. Right. So this angle is also 42 degrees. So that is how we can reason out and solve the given question based on circle theorem. I hope that helps. Feel free to share your views and subscribe to my videos. Thank you and all the best.